Now ahead of the general elections and as candidates continue to declare intentions for political interest, Nigerians have been advised to look out for people with immediate track records before voting for them. An Anglican priest in the Diocese of Kaduna, Venerable Dr. Oluwatosi Adeke, gave this advice in an interview with ACNN TV News crew in Abuja, where he stated that Nigerians must learn to sit down and check when people performed and under what circumstances they performed, saying that it is important to elect those with immediate track record. The first thing is to look, first of all, at people with track records. Now, what happens many times is we become very ethnic, we become very um, biased, we become very skewed in the way we take decisions. Okay, I'm going to vote this person because he's from my ethnic group. I'm going to vote this person because he's from my denomination. I'm going to vote this person because it looks like he's been endorsed. Now, a lot of that is what has brought us to where we are at today. We need to be able to sit down and look at records and look at when people performed and under what circumstance they performed. Now, you bring somebody who was in the military. This is a civilian Era. And you think that he can repeat what he did in the 80s, in the 2020s. The circumstances are different. It just shows you that he has the capacity, but he's been out of touch for so long. So we quickly say, oh, because he did it in the 70s, he can do it now. Things have changed. He may find, get in there and find that the machinery with which to do it is no longer there what's available there, he's out of touch with it, he can't manipulate it, he can't use it, and suddenly he's stuck. He won't come back to say to you that there's a problem. He's just going to try to leave out his tenure. And by the time he's gone, he leaves. And then we have a problem. So we, we, it's like technology. We need to look at people who have an immediate track record of performance to be able to say he did this in the digital period, he should be able to do this. And that's what I would say to all of us. We need to look and we need to look critically. Our future depends on it. Our lives depend on it. Our country depends on it. We can't travel the way we used to anymore. We're not as free as we used to anymore. And this is simply, I think, the reason why we do all of this.